He is one of Haiti's most powerful gang leaders, and his threats risk plunging Haiti into deeper chaos. Jimmy Cherizier, a former cop known as Barbecue, heads the so-called G9 Federation of Nine Gangs. In a new video address, he says his men would take to the streets to protest the assassination of President Jovenel Moïse. Many people from the opposition and stinking bourgeoisie joined together to betray the president. It is a national and international conspiracy against the Haitian people. I ask all the gangs to mobilize, take to the streets. We demand explanations about the assassination of the president. We had a problem with the president, but we have never said that foreigners can enter our territory to kill the president. Moïse was gunned down before dawn on Wednesday at his Port-au-Prince home. Haitian authorities say a unit of trained assassins compromising 26 Colombians and two Haitian Americans carried out the murder. The murder and the still murky plot behind it has caused further political instability in the long troubled country. The government is calling for US and UN assistance. The US says it has no plans to provide Haiti with military assistance for now, while the request to the UN would need Security Council authorization. Chezier says his followers will practice legitimate violence and that it's time for the masters of the system, business magnates of Syrian and Lebanese descent who dominate parts of the economy, to give back the country. Some of the magnates had been at loggerheads with Moïse. <laughs> Meanwhile, in a taped recording, Moïse's widow Martine, who was also wounded in the attack, accused shadowy enemies of plotting his assassination to thwart democratic change. She says her husband had spoken of dark forces behind years of unrest. Rivals and oligarchs angry about what he called his attempts to clean up government contracts and politics. Haitian officials have not provided a motive for the assassination or explained how the killers got past Moïse's security detail.